Let's find a supplement of 7 pi over 8. Now this is in radian because it doesn't have the degrees. So um, for supplementary angles, uh, when you're dealing with radians, they add up to pi. So to find a supplement of 7 pi over 8, we need to subtract it from pi. So pi minus 7 pi over 8. Now if you're going to subtract fractions, they both should be fractions. So I'll put the pi over 1 minus 7 pi over 8. And we need to get a common denominator. Well, common denominator would be 8. Very easy way is just to multiply these two together. But uh, that isn't always the least common denominator. So 8 is going to be our new denominator. Now our second fraction already has that, so we leave that alone. Now our first uh, fraction, we multiply the bottom part by 8, and we also multiply the top part by 8. So uh, 8 times pi gives us 8 pi. Now since they have the same denominator, I can subtract the top parts. 8 pi minus 7 pi is 1 pi, or just simply pi over 8. And how that would be input is uh, pi and then um, slash uh, 8. Now, um, if you're not very good with fractions, you can use your calculator to do this. If you just have pi here, remember there's a invisible 1 in front of it. So we can do 1 minus 7 eighths on our TA384. So I do 1 minus 7 divided by 8. Press enter. And whenever you get a decimal, you can do math, enter, enter. Now change it to fraction. And you see we got 1 eighth which this is um, 1 1 eighth pi. So that's how you can use calculator to do that.